Guys and girls, are you looking for a way to change your iPad into an Android style tablet? Well, if so, you're going to want to check out this Dreamboard theme right here. It's called Honeypad, as you see, Honeypad Pro, actually. And there it is, folks. There is the Android theme for the iPad. Now, of course, this is running on the Dreamboard framework. So, you know, if you're familiar with Dreamboard, you kind of know what you get. But this one is extremely like well done, extremely in depth, extremely deep. There's a lot of flexibility here, so I'm going to show you uh, to do some things that you've probably never seen on any theme on the iPad. So let me just show you all the different features. You have wallpapers, themes, and I'm going to go ahead and enable this HTC Flyer theme. Just hit apply there and watch how it dynamically changes right before your eyes. It's very easy, very slick, um, and very simple to use. Let me show you something else real cool. This is called shift mode. If I hit shift mode, and just hit OK there. You can actually drag these widgets around freely with your finger. Pretty cool, isn't it? Uh, you can drag any of the widgets around. You can organize them just like you like them. And then all you do is tap Save. And then they're stuck right in the position that you place them in. So that is extremely nice to use. Now here are all the, the apps. You have various sections, all favorites, games, socials, utilities. And then in the upper right hand corner, you'll see the little Android Marketplace icon that takes you of course directly to the app store so let's check out some other interesting features you have all these widgets here you have facebook calendar calculator the clock and you can enable or disable any of those on the fly you can enter edit mode which allows you to actually edit the shortcut icons on your home screen you can see it's kind of sideways but you can see you can replace any of these apps quickly and conveniently just by entering edit mode here now it's no surprise that the wallpaper itself dynamically changes upon selecting it just like this. You see the famed lion wallpaper. Speaking of dynamically changing, let's try this Asus ePad uh, theme here and check that out. There it is, folks. This is the Asus ePad. And as you can see, it's very similar, but you get a different sort of layout, a uh, different sort of look and feel that matches that Asus tablet. Now, as you just saw, just hit the Google link in the upper left-hand corner. Let me try the microphone link. And as you can see, they really don't do much. All it does is link you directly to Safari, and that's to be expected. So let's mosey on back over to our Dreamboard application and switch back into normal mode. All you do is tap the normal icon set. And let's head over to City. I'm going to show you a little bit about this theme, where you can get it, how much it costs. It, this is $2.99, by the way. It is called Honeypad. It allows you to emulate the Motorola Zoom, the HTC Flyer, and the Asus ePad. It is available on the Mac City repo. So if this is interesting to you, please let me know in the comment section below. Let me know if you check it out. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.